Alright guys, pitching ace 88, and... Okay, sweet. Horn calf. Let's kill him. Um, this, is, this is pitching ace 88, part 40... 48 of my really nice little Republic walkthrough. Game brought to you by GameAnyone.com. And we're going to head back to the council to talk to them about my findings with, or our findings with the Star Forge. But, and you could, you could, uh, go back to the Even Hawk or do that quick travel thing, but don't, I'm not going to worry about that so much. I'd rather go back, fight a little bit. Bastila has her night speed, so it's not, doesn't take as long. So we're pretty much done, actually, with this with this uh, planet. It's, it's been fun. I mean, I like the colors. Oh my gosh! So I just talked to her, but I need to talk to her again. Let's speak to her. How can I help? Looks like something's bothering you. No, not bothering me. Not exactly. I've been thinking about what the Jedi Council said about the two of us. There is a bond between us. I do not dispute that. I can feel it, as I'm sure you can. The nature of that bond and its effect on our mission remain in question. I think you're more you're more interested in more than just the bond between us. Now it gets interesting. Oh, please. I'm a Jedi. Such feelings, such attractions are well they're beneath me, quite frankly. I admit I find you intriguing. I Yeah, you do. I mean I find your command of the force intriguing, but uh -huh. my interest in you is purely academic. Surely you can understand why. Our fates are strongly connected. So connected that a literal bond has been forged between us. I saw your service records when you were transferred aboard the Ender Spire, but nothing beyond that. I know very little about you. I'd like to ask you some questions, given our relationship. Our relationship? Is this kind of some kind of clumsy come on? I was referring to the bond we share. The one the Jedi Council spoke of. If I was actually interested in you, rest assured I could come up with a much better approach than this. Whoa, gets touch a nerve there, huh? Touched a nerve? No. Getting on my nerves, most definitely. I suppose this is what you men consider being witty. Now, are you going to answer my questions, or would you rather just keep annoying me? Uh, the second one, no, I'll answer a Don't few worry. questions. These are simple questions, nothing too intrusive. First, what kind of background do you have? Uh, I'm a hut in human form plotting to overthrow the Republic. No, nothing is shrapnel. Oh, cool. I'm a soldier. On which planet were you born? Derelia. It's a remote system. Why? Excellent. The current age is? Wasn't this all in the service records? Yes. Well, the truth is, I was studying how you responded to my questions. Your reactions helped me judge you. This was a test for me to learn more about your character. Ooh, and what did you find? You were honest, which is good. And you treated this as a serious matter, which it is. This bond we share will shape both our destinies. It is not to be taken lightly. But I imagine you've had enough questions for a while. So many things have happened to you since Taurus. It's probably a lot for you to absorb. We can speak again later, after you've had time to think about all this. I've been thinking about this all the time. So, okay, we've got Bastila, Candorus, we'll talk to them more. Uh, when I get back to the ship, I'm going to talk to Karth a little bit more. Alright, let's yeah. be Basla, go really, really fast. Now we're gonna go up the to a place where I have not been yet. For obvious reasons, because there's someone up here that Yes. What do you want? Now Samt, don't be so rude. If it wasn't for this young Jedi, we wouldn't have met. Oh. I, I took the loss of my droid much too hard. I feel I must apologize. There's no need. But I must. I was much too attached to my droid. It was all that was left of my husband, you see. Maybe I thought that through the droid, my husband could live again, be with me still. I think we understand. Love can do strange things to anyone. But I went too far. I could yeah, not see what was missing in living a normal life. Fortunately, in my grief, I returned here and ran into Samt. 
An absolutely fascinating man. Yeah, he seems quite nice. Sam and I got to talking, and, well, we have a lot in common. I think we'll be seeing more of each other. It's funny how things work out in the end. Maybe there is such a thing as fate, after all. But I think we should be going now. We have so much more to talk about. I just wanted to thank you for what you've done for me, and what you tried to do. Goodbye, and thank you. Sweet, so you get a journal entry added. I don't even think that was part of it. Yo, missing companion, so yeah. Cool. Um, and I believe if... Yeah, if you're... If with the Shen Matal feud, if you weren't able to convince the parents to buy their own house, they'll, they'll be in here and you can talk to them in here as they run away from their parents. But Persuasion, one out. Care for a game. Too many cards to sell? Uh, let's see. Plus or minus are always good. Take a couple of those. Take a couple of those. I'm good. So, nice speed. We're going to head back to the Jedi training grounds. Before we go to the council, I'm going to upgrade some of my lightsabers because I want to. So, let's see. I These are equipped. This is equipped for me. Damage attack one. I want to stun, assemble it. Damage attack and damage energy. Alright, cool. Yeah, Basila can get hers when whenever she wants. I kind of like her yellow. Yeah. I want a green one, though. Green. Oh, you have to assemble it. Yes, sir. Yeah, I like that, colors. But I want hers to be red. I want her to be, like, evil. Okay, you got nothing there. Okay, so that's kind of glitch glitching out on me a little bit. Here we go. Ah, you have returned, young Padawan. Have you discovered what it was that Revan and Malak sought in those ruins? I did. We found an incomplete star map and a mention of something called a Star Forge. This news of a Star Forge is disturbing. Action is required, but we must not do so in haste. We must discuss recent events in light of this new information. We should consult the Jedi Archives to see if there's any mention of the Star Forge and what it might do. We must learn why Revan and Malak sought it out. Return to your ship with Bastila, and we will summon you when we are done. Padawan. You have done well in discovering the star map hidden within the ancient ruins. But there is more you must do in the battle against Malak and the Sith. We Jedi, no victory over the Sith will not come through martial might. The Council has a mission for you, Padawan. I've consulted our vast archives in an effort to discover the nature of this Star Forge. But all my efforts have been in vain. Still, the Council are in agreement. The Star Forge must be found. Revan and Malak sought it out when they began their tragic fall. The Star Forge is surely a powerful tool of the dark side. The star map in the ruins showed you four planets, but it was incomplete. It did not show the location of the Star Forge itself. We believe there may be similar star maps on other planets. Each star map is likely a small piece of a larger puzzle. Find the star maps on Kashyyyk, Tatooine, Manam and Korriban, and we believe they will lead you to the Star Forge. I'm ready to do the Council's will. The Jedi numbers have been ravaged by this war, by defections to Malak's cause, and by Sith assassins. But we realize the importance of this mission. Yet if we send a company of Jedi Knights with you, we would surely draw the full attention of Malak and the Sith, dooming your efforts to failure. Am I to undertake this task alone? Secrecy is our best defense against the Sith. But it would be foolish to send you on this quest without someone to aid you, young Padawan. Bastila will accompany you. For there is a powerful connection between you two. A connection that might be the key to unraveling the mysteries uncovered by Revan. And Juhani has also asked to accompany you. After long deliberation, 
We have granted her request. Jahani nearly fell to the dark side. Perhaps her presence will serve as a reminder to you of the dangers of that path. Great Basil and the Catwoman. Anyone else you want to stick me with? It's pretty good. The others? Okay. Looks like we're about out of time. This has been Pitching Ace 88. We'll pick it up in the next video where we will, I think, be going to a new world. See you guys in the next video. I am out.